Ness is an artist, uh, but his medium isn't paint or even yeah, pottery. It's, it's, it's concrete. I think it's a beautiful medium to work with. Him. Ness was at the Bronx Zoo when he noticed many of the animals' enclosures, which were made to look like stone, were actually made of concrete. So everything was synthetic. I was just shocked. Um, I have an artist background, and so just that kind of planted a seed within me to kind of investigate this and find out how they're doing this stuff. He's been doing this stuff himself for about eight years now, either in the studio behind his home or on locations all over the Northwest, sculpting museum quality foescapes with concrete. Water features, retaining walls, um, those are some, some real big ones, some hardscape systems, interior fireplaces, showers, um, you're trying to bring nature inside. It starts by mixing sand, concrete, and what Ness calls his special sauce, developed by watching how concrete performs in the Northwest freeze and thaw environment. Rock Sculptor uses a variety of simple tools to replicate nature. So there's a lot of study involved with that, and um, I like to take the detail to the utmost, the highest level um, possible. Giving the concrete some geometry is the key. If you're doing rock, you know, there's, there's definitely some commonalities within the rock. 30 degree kicks this way, the fractures run this way. There's laws within it. Rock Sculptor can provide even the smallest details for your project. All of these lichens on this monolithic wine rack, even they are made of concrete. The fantasy artist integrates all these cool things inside one picture. We're doing, trying to do the same thing with concrete. The cracks, the, the, the fractures, lichens, simulated biology, moss. The works. Most of Rock Sculptor's clients say the look is so real they can hardly believe it's concrete. They touch and feel it and they, they just can't believe. It's just, it's very gratifying at the end of the day to see a client just blown away at what can be done with concrete. Ness loves the medium so much he's now offering training in an effort to see his craft grow throughout the Northwest. The knowledge that I've learned over the years and that they can implement that, I think it's a win-win for everybody including the clients from Maine the Northwest I'm Derek Dice KXLY4 News